The Lord has a special work to do for us individually. As we see the wickedness of the world brought to light in the courts of justice and published in the daily papers, let us draw near to God and by living faith lay hold of His promises that the grace of God may be manifest in us. We may have an influence, a powerful influence in the world. If the convicting power of God is with us, we shall be enabled to lead souls that are in sin to conversion. Our simplicity will accomplish much in this work. We are not to try to climb up to high positions or to gain the praise of men. Our aim should not be to be the greatest. We are to have an eye single to the glory of God. We are to work with all the intelligence that God has given us, placing ourselves in the channel of light, that the grace of God can come upon us to mold and fashion us to the divine similitude. Heaven is waiting to bestow its richest blessings upon those who will consecrate themselves to do the work of God in these last days of the world's history. We shall be tested and tried. We may be called to spend wakeful nights, but let such times be spent in earnest prayer to God, that He may give understanding and quicken the mind to discern the privileges that are ours.